Hi, it's uh, Joe here from Data Analytics Ireland. We do weekly blog posts, live streams, and video tutorials on everything and anything data analytics. So today we're going to talk about type error. List indices must be integers or slices and not tuples. So let's head over to the code, see how we can fix this, and see how you can get your problem that you've come to this video for resolved. See you in a bit. Okay, right, so, uh, <clears throat> excuse me. Uh, probably the first thing uh, before we look at this error is just try to understand uh, lists and lists of lists and how they're generated and how to put together. So as we know, uh, lists are generally within brackets, okay? And sometimes what you can have is a list of lists, which basically means you have one or more lists inside a list, okay? Which is perfect. Um, normally when it's formatted correctly, everybody's happy and it works correctly. So what we're going to do here, first of all, is actually look at the generation of a list. So we have two lists here, A and B. And then we have an empty list, okay? This is a list, the list, okay? And then we have, we're gonna append A here and B here into this list of lists. And then we're just gonna print it and we're basically gonna print the type. So in essence, if you look here, um, out in the output here, over here, we basically have a list and contained within it is two lists. So the first list is A, one, two, three, comma, and then four, five, six. Okay, close close the square bracket. So that is a list of lists, and that's how you generate them. But why is that relevant to this error and how it comes about? Well, essentially, if we just, um, I'm gonna just comment this out here now. Okay, uh, if we bring this code down here a bit. We've got a list here, and it's exactly the same as above, okay? But the reason being, if you are manually generating this list, so up here, we basically, when the list is generated, it actually formatted in the right way that you didn't get an error. But if you're say manually generating or creating it yourself and you don't format it in the right way, you're gonna get this error. So the most obvious and glaring thing here is that we basically are missing the comma. So if we run this first, okay. Just run this, okay. So there's your error. And this is what we're here for, type error, list indices must be integers or slices, not tuple, okay? Now, the reason for this is when the code looks at this, it looks at two lists and it looks for their indices, but it doesn't basically, it finds two lists, but it doesn't find a separator. So, so, so we basically can't find where the, the one list stops and the second list um, starts. So therefore we're gonna try out this error. And basically, the in reference to integers or slices essentially is trying to create the indexes for each one. So that would be zero and that would be one. So the way to fix this and this error in general is you basically put a comma in between the two lists. And that basically tells the program that there's a separator between the two lists. So therefore, two separate lists within a list, and um, both of them can be signed index values. The first one being zero, the second one being one, unless you in programmatically the, uh, the assign different index values. So if we basically do this here now, and we just run this again, okay. There you go. So there's your list, and your two lists are essentially the same as the output before. So what are the other scenarios where this might happen as well? It might necessarily be with this list, and this might be other ways of which this may happen. Well, I'll show you now. Um, if we just do this, if we go down here a little bit extra in the code, okay. Um, see here now we have, we'll just get, move the comments. So what we have here is a list of A, one, one two, three, four, five. Uh, what we basically want to is print out A, but we want to basically say only print out certain values here, okay. And this instance start at zero and go two out to two values. So when we run this, okay, it's also going to give us this error. Okay, sizes. And the reason being is again we it's just a typing error or an error in your program. It's you've got that comma in. So up here, we base we're missing the comma. In here, actually apologies, I should have down here, I'll just get rid of this here, and put that to two. 
down here because we have the comma included it essentially went and ran the program says but hold on i don't like this comma this doesn't allow me me being the program to format and get out the particular set of data the program has been asked for so now if we run we rerun this okay just do this here now okay and that gives you the values of one and two so it basically says start at start at the point zero at the very first one and then give you back the first two values so it starts here this is zero and then it says give me back the first two values so it gives me one two so that is another scenario where again it's in the formatting or in typing your code um that you will get this problem as i said earlier on that uh, if you are manually creating them this is potentially open to error if you're using the functions or methods that the program gives you usually you won't see this error because they will make sure that's formatted and the output is in the correct format okay so let's just look at another scenario where this might be a problem Okay, so you might be trying to loop over a list of lists. <clears throat> and again, uh, looping through a list of lists, it will be using the index values to return what you need. So similar to the very first problem, when you're looping through the list of lists, it's important that if you've manually created it, that the actual formatting of the list of lists is in the correct way that it's required. So that the program can read it, understand it, and then understand what it needs to give you and give it in the format and output that you need. So here we've got a index for index, looking for index. So it's basically, again, it's looking for the index values and then it's looking for the values. Um, and this is enumerated, it's basically looping through A and A is this variable here. But as you can see earlier on in the program, similar to what was up here is we, I know we put it in there, but we were originally missing that uh, comma. So again, the problem here is that in any list list split the list up so that you can divide them into their different index values basically um put the comma in the comma will separate them out and give you index values and I'll subsequently give you the values you need so let's reprint these here um, okay so it's basically given out the index value zero one after enumerating over looping over that variable a. So that is in essence how we fix the type error list indices must be integer slices, not tuple. So there's one last thing to discuss. What is the reference to tuple? So let's have a look at that now. Right, so um, the final thing just to go through is uh, why there was a reference to the tuple. So as discussed earlier on, when we are running this program, it basically creates two lists with two index values. But when it's actually, uh, because it's two lists, it's looking to create the index values, those index values go into a tuple, okay? But because um, we've missed the comma, it basically can't create a, list, or a tuple with the values in this instance it would be zero and one, and therefore it can't create the list. So the reference to the tuple in this scenario is in the program when it's running um, the logic in the background, it's trying to create the index values in a tuple, but because um, there's it, most likely there's a comma missing in between the lists, which are in the list, the main list, um, it can't create the tuple with the index values and therefore it's referencing not tuple and hence it is added in to the error value that you see. So I hope you liked today, I hope you liked this video, I hope it's explained how the problem occurs, where are there likely scenarios where it may occur. It could occur manually where you're creating lists of lists and forgetting to put in the comma. Um, also explains why the reference to tuple comes out in the error. I uh, do lots of videos on uh, type, these type of errors in for Python, do videos on in OR and also done some machine learning and data visualization. So thanks for coming along. We hope you're keeping well. Please hit the like and subscribe button if you haven't done already. Plenty more videos to come for you to learn and get more insight and knowledge of how you can apply some of these techniques to your data analytics projects. 
Look after yourself, take care, and we'll see you soon.